back with a mindset shift that will transform your engineering career. Nobody's coming to save you. You need to save yourself. That's the core of it here. There's nobody coming. You need to take accountability for your own position, your own status, and your own progression throughout your career. There's nobody coming. To that end, if you really wanna get ahead in your career, you need to learn how to play the game or you're going to lose. There is no opting out of the game. You are playing the game. There's no opting out. If you're at work, you're playing the game. So play the game. If you're playing it like a game and you're following along with emotional and social intelligence on my channel here, you should have no issue not taking things so personally at work. A lot of times people don't really think about those around them because they aren't really paying attention to themselves or those around them. And a lot of those things, it's quite easy to take quite personally. So just remember Hanlon's razor. Never attribute to malice that which is adequately explained by stupidity. In this particular instance, I'm saying the person effectively didn't think about you, so stop taking it so personally off the get-go. Little tips like this is how you start to play the game a bit better and have a better emotional health while you're playing the game. Because there's nobody coming to save you, you need to look out for yourself. There will be inflection points in your career where you see your organization do something that really startles you or you have someone pass away that's close to you that will bring you a lot of pause when it comes to what am I doing here? Why am I here? What's gonna happen after this? It's in these moments, it's incredibly important that you press on. Don't let these things completely stop you. Keep your momentum up, keep your output up. If you can take this nobody's coming mentality with you everywhere you go in the office, it's gonna make you incredibly self-reliant and that will help you grow your skill set to where you're going to be able to go do whatever you want in your career. And if you're following along with the emotional and social intelligence aspects of this channel, you're going to have a great professional network and you're going to find people in your network that are doing what you wanna be doing and you're going to start working backwards how they got there. And using them as a mentor maybe is a perfect way for you to start making those steps up to that position you wanna to get to. So you should go pay attention, have high integrity, and remember that there's nobody coming to save you. I trust you've been paying attention to this emotional intelligence video thus far. I want to help you pay even better attention to your emotional and social intelligence by clicking the link below this video and scheduling a free call with me. On the call, we'll come up with a personalized plan for you to start getting bigger raises, faster promotions, and stronger relationships with everyone around you. Don't delay, click that link below and schedule a call with me today.